Welcome to Nicky Gris Motorsports. Um, we're very excited because in 2021, we've got something new to share with you. Um, Stilo are renowned for their WRC Rally Helmet. The iconic microphone boom really did take the rally scene by storm. And to celebrate 10 years of the launch of that helmet, they came up with the WRC DES. With a change in the microphone boom peak, um, it offered a new styling on what was the original concept of this static microphone boom. Of course, this has been very, very popular over the years. But for 2021, we've got something new, something to celebrate 20 years of the WRC. And now we've got the Venti. The Venti is not the largest coffee from Starbucks, Venti being 20 in the local dialect of Stilo. So they've come up with a new shape. The homologations are all the same as the current range of helmets. So in terms of the strength and safety, the safety is still there throughout the whole range. The Venti currently will only be available in carbon and uh, 8859 and carbon 8860 and going up into the zero, the top of the range lightweight helmet as used on the WRC. What have they done? Well, basically we've come up again with a new modern shape. It's quite angular. To be honest, I quite like it. You can see that the microphone boom on the front, we've lost that foil area in front of the microphone now very angular sharp and a little bit pointed but there's some subtle changes in the boom with um, a ridge that goes right the way through maybe difficult to see that on the carbon helmet because it just blends in to the black carbon now if i twist it to the side a little bit and you'll probably notice it from the top you can see that we've got a new shape on the on the peak but if you look at it side on you can see here how very pointed it is now. Again, that just to give it a new look and a new feel. In addition to that, we've got some new um, angular shapes on the helmet. We've lost one that was in the original design here, but they've added one which is in line more or less with the SD5 full face helmet, just to give a new look and feel, but also make this sh the shell quite strong. And it does give it, although again difficult to see on the carbon some angular shapes here at the at the back to give it that different look and feel if i twist it again to the side this one has the 8860 uh, inset intercom plug um, socket on it which it won't have on the base version but they've actually changed the um, intercom port on the side and that again is a very angular shape. Now, as mentioned, the Venti will only be coming in carbon and 8860 and above for the foreseeable future. All the composite helmets are going to stay currently with the um, 8859 standard helmet, the FIA 8859, and we're looking at probably 12 to 24 months of this uh, composite version. Something else that's coming in the future and in the very near future will be a new intercom system with alignment with the Venti version, but we'll come back with more news on that in the near future.